This is BSSD Television, Blue Springs, Missouri. From BSSD TV, this is a news update covering school districts and communities throughout Jackson County. Hello everyone, I'm Pete Grigsby and this is a BSSD television news update. Thank you for joining us. Well, school teachers from all across the Midwest gathered together at Kansas City at historic sites, all in the name of education and American history. They came from Kansas, Missouri, Iowa, and Nebraska, all to sharpen their skills in American history. The two-day conference was held at historic sites such as Truman Library, Union Station, and the World War I Museum at Liberty Memorial. History Channel's host of the hit show, How the States Got Their Shapes, was there to share some ideas and insight to American history. Well, I'm a student of history, always have been, of politics and history, and I think the most fun of the show is seeing the interconnection between who we are today, politically and cultural, and tracing that back to us as a geographical uh, notion, the shape of our states, uh, the why behind why the lines are drawn the way they are, who drew them, was it done by Congress, was it done by a king or a queen, or is it the product of a backroom handshake in some bar? Um, the answers are very surprising, but they hold the clues to who we are today and our identities. The event was sponsored by the Blue Spring School District and was offered free of charge to teachers needing required personal training hours. I, I'm just so thrilled with the resources that are here. I can't wait to go through the World War I Museum. I'm a huge World War I fan. I think the period from uh, post-Civil War to the Great Depression is the most interesting time in American history. It's when we went from sort of a backwater country to being a world superpower virtually overnight in historical terms. And I think it's the most fascinating part of American history. And um, I, I see a lot of pieces of that history right here in the, in the Kansas City and in, in, um, in Missouri area. So I'm really excited to get to learn more about the history here. Motivational speaker Rocky Blyer was on hand, sharing his experiences of serving in the Vietnam War to winning Super Bowls with the Pittsburgh Steelers. That, do you know the impact that you have? It's not about you, but the impact that you have on the children that you teach year after year after year and the difference that you can make in somebody's life um, because of your attitude, your enthusiasm, how you broach the subject, how you teach the subject, and your passion. So if we talk about history, and we talk about patriotism, we talk about leadership, it all comes back, at least from my point of view, to how you present that material. Teachers also had the opportunity of checking out the brand new learning bus. This high-tech computer lab on wheels will travel into neighborhoods throughout the Blue Spring School District, delivering educational tools to the community. Well, the Teaching American History Con Conference was just really exciting to join together with my fellow American history teachers and talk about the subject that we love. And I came away with some good information from other presenters and some new perspectives. And that always helps me, as I'm teaching kids, think of new ideas that will enhance my own classroom. And overall, an educational and fun event for all those who attended. As you can see, the conference provided a great balance between instructional strategies and content knowledge. Now to change gears just for a second, let's head over to Independent School District where they're saying goodbye to the current superintendent. After 12 great years with the Independent School District, Dr. Henson has accepted a new job with the Shawnee Mission Kansas School District and will begin working there July 1st. The Independent School Board will post the superintendent vacancy this week and will begin its search for a new superintendent immediately. Now in the city of Grain Valley, earlier last month, voters passed a bond issue that will help their school district and it begins now. The vote passed with 80% support and now well needed renovations can move forward for the Grain Valley School District. Expansion on the high school has begun as Grain Valley High School expands to accommodate the growing community and its needs. Now over in the Oak Grove School District, their spring break hits the end of this month. Oak Grove Spring Break will be Friday, March 29th and Monday, April 1st, giving the students and staff a four-day weekend. Now, if you would like to check out the school districts and their websites throughout Jackson County, all you have to do is go to our website, bssdtv.net. If you have a news event or story you'd like to share right here on BSSD Television, contact us through our website. 
And don't forget, our commercial-free radio station, bssdradio.net, powered by students. I'm Pete Grigsby. Have a great day. Be sure to stay tuned to BSSD-TV for the latest news and weather.